Hello friend, welcome back to Toyota Maintenance YouTube channel. This is hard to make video for me because I will reveal something bad about this wonderful 2005 Toyota Sequoia. Talking bad about her breaks my heart because she's one of the best and most reliable vehicles we ever owned. Look how huge she is! She is so ginormous and that means she's really safe. When I'm driving here, when I'm inside, I feel invincible. It's like driving a tank. Absolutely safe. We were moving this year in the April, so all we did, I just removed all the seats and it's ginormous it's like in the living room let me show you it's so big without those seats huge pieces of furniture and everything fitted here you can definitely two people can go camping and sleep here it's super long and I'm driving alone most of the time right I don't have those seats so the truck doesn't have that extra weight in it and this engine, this V8 4.7 liter I-Force, it's so powerful. I'm barely touching the throttle and she accelerates with absolute ease. When I drive my wife's Honda Ridgeline, which has a V6 in it, right, I feel a huge difference in the power. No kidding. So if everything is so good, so peachy, why am I whining in this video? Why am I complaining? So let me show you right now. So let's hop in together and I will show you finally what I'm talking about. Let me start her up. And where the probe line will be visible? Well, it's actually here. This computer on board computer will help me to explain so if you go this is actually super cool between European right and metric so in Europe this will be 19 degrees Celsius right and in US it's a 67 Fahrenheit I love this thing another great feature about it but look, if you go through the mode, now comes that absolute heartbreak and shocker. I'm averaging, driving alone, very, very gently, economic driving with the barely touching the throttle. I'm averaging 14 miles per gallon. And none of it is really in the city, right? We don't live in the city, we are in the rural, Northern California so I'm drive on the highway most of the time and it's only 14 miles per gallon in Europe that will mean she consumes 16.6 liters per 100 kilometers and that's brutal and this was okay like two years ago when the gas here was like three bucks per gallon but man we are suddenly paying here in Northern California like 430, 440 per gallon. And right now it's completely killing me. It's crazy. But always look on the bright side of the life, right? You know what's good news? It's the only one thing which is bad about this truck. Everything else is awesome. She's super easy to maintain. She works tirelessly, never quit, single hiccup, nothing. Because she's two-wheel drive, super easy to work on, right? Just incredible, incredible used truck. So I wanted to share really quickly this with you. If you are ever considering buying one of these big sequoias, make sure you can afford the gas because the way I'm driving, right, we moved, so I'm driving further to my job every day, to my garage, and that gas gauge is just going like this, and every fill up, every single fill up, it's super costly, so, yep, short video for you, 
make sure sure you are subscribed because I will always have more videos for you soon. Thanks for watching and have a great day my friend.